So this level also, it's split depending on your lord's combined level, you'll go to a different place. If your lord's combined level is 50 or greater, you'll go to a like harder version of four feigned offense. And then if they're less than that, you'll go to like one that's kind of easier, but it also has fog. Oh, that's a great disguise. Look at that. No one will ever know. He doesn't cover his like distinctive <laughs> red hair. He just puts on like a cool Jedi robe. Do, 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 do. Is this so we're gonna get the Wallace level? You think? Yeah, we're at the Wallace level. Hmm. <laughs> Lynn's okay. Lynn's disguise is at least like kind of good because like she's not super distinctive. But like Hector's, it's like his armor's sticking out of it. <laughs> like look at that. He has like, a cool collar. <laughs> yeah, really. Lynn is the only one who like looks like she could be in the skies. And it's still basically like in Aladdin when Jasmine like is like, ah, yeah. like, goes out into it's the, the city. Exact same she doesn't even take her jewelry off. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh, Disney princess is not the smartest. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. Pent and Louise are related to the queen. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. So many little details. Subtle. Very subtle. So just to give people like an exact time and place this is taking place, Rogue One, a Star Wars story. <laughs> yes, it that is the subtitle, like possibly a one of the worst of subtitles Wall. of all time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, a tale of Redwall. <laughs> has just come out, and I do want to see it, but I have not seen it yet. Okay. I, are you at all excited for it? You're like, I will not even bother. I don't, I honestly, like, not at all. I'm like completely 100% neutral on this movie. So like, so like, if, I so basically if it was, was on in the background, you'll be like, oh yeah, I'd watch that, but like, yeah, you're not gonna like yeah. go to the theater. But I'm not gonna go out of my way to see it. Oh yeah, Nino. This is kind of where you get some dynamic where it's like, these guys aren't like evil, they're just like working for the wrong side, kind of. Yeah. Is Linus the one with the beard? No, that's Void. Linus is the more hot-headed one. So we have Legal randomly That's... like comes into this place. Yeah, Legal's like a huge character in the story. No, okay, so Legal, is it like a cool, stylish, like side necklace that he wears across his oh, face? Oh, also or a scar. <laughs> <laughs> it's a scar. And also, this means Legal has scars on both sides of his face. Because we've seen him facing both ways. Oh, you're right. <laughs> they literally just mirrored the sprite. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Rico's got two giant scars. It's like a Nika Montoya, where it's like he fought some guy and he gave him two scars. <laughs> it's true. Oh yeah. Oh man, a Nico Montoya would be so good in this game. What? A Nico Montoya would be so good in this game. <laughs> Fezzik would be better though. Also, I kind of just okay. So here's here's kind of what I realized about this game, like just now. So the first half of Elwood's story is like, we gotta find Elwood's dad. Then it's like you find Elwood's dad. It's like we gotta stop the bad guys. Well, right, but it's like he's not really going after the bad guys to like get revenge on them for killing his dad. No, they're he's nice. more just like oh, I guess I gotta protect this random blue-haired girl now. Yeah, but like there's basically two parts. Yeah, so if we got the other version, it would be at a completely different stage, and we'd go against Linus instead of Lloyd. We have the honor of dying at one of the four fanes. Okay, that guy is like literally screaming, I'm an assassin! Look at me! Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Counter attack! Oh, oh yeah, he actually kind of looks like an assassin, except his eyes are showing. So help with you reference. Okay, Afa's drops. Who do you use them on? Give it, wait, does that just increase support? I no, it, I think it like lets you level up slightly faster and increases the amount you level up. So, so they're oh, good. Dang. They're good. I want to give, give it to Hector. <laughs> <laughs> no, Hector's gonna be good enough as is. I might give them to someone like. He's um, also like almost level Lowen. 20. Oh, what? Lowen's already. Also, awesome. whoever you give the Aphis drops to, they like are. It's their face on the final report. Weirdly enough, it's their face. Yeah, so you know how it's like, oh, for Lynn's story, at the final report, it's like Lynn's face, and then it's usually Elwood's face, but it's like whoever you give the Aphis drops to, it'll be their face on the final report in the battle history. Oh. That's weird. Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, Sarah's only a level 12. She's terrible. You can level her up whenever, though. Like, I probably wouldn't recommend getting her all the way to 20. If probably not, but she's got some really bad level ups. Okay, dart. Let's see. Ste I'll give you the steel axe. Get the ocean seal. Or no. From the yacht. Give me that. I should probably cut all this part out. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of boring. We're not really talking about anything cool. <laughs> we talked about Rogue One, but we don't really have anything to say about it. Yeah, that's true. We haven't seen it. All right, you know what? I'm getting bored of the barrier and unlock. That was pretty good. I need physic, and I need a guiding ring. Are oh yeah, how was Moana? Uh, it was. It was good. It was good overall. Sorry, that was. Uh, uh, I was saying uh, before I really comprehended your question. Mono is really good. Um, okay, I, it, I, it's nice to have like a Disney princess movie that's not just like about her being a princess. Oh, that's nice. It's kind of like Mulan, where it's like, no, it's about like how strong she is as a character, okay. and it's just secondary that she's like in a position. I'm of thinking of giving the Athos drops to Lin. Good or bad idea? Bad idea. It's Lin. Are you gonna use Lin? I'm trying to. Or Dart. Dart will not need it. I okay. would I would do Lid or Sarah. Or here's something. I'll give you the Aphis drops if you give me a uh, Knight's Crest. Mm, I don't really need the Knights the, or the Aphis drops. Well, I'm need a Knight's Crest. So... Well, one's got uh, two levels away, and Oswald's pretty close. We'll deal with that when we get there. We might get here now. I'm bringing Wallen. <laughs> He needs his Knight's Crest. <laughs> How many Knight's Crest do I have? Two? You have two, but one's in Kent's hands, and Kent's gonna use it. Yeah, I'll do it, I guess. Alright. Now that I have a Guiding Ring as well. Alright, Lowen. Get rid of that Javelin with the one. <laughs> yeah. I want Tenji. <laughs> He's like, oh, with this stick? Alright, Link. Go right ahead. I already have everything I need, basically. Like Constantine. Yeah. Oh, yes! We can get six guys apiece. Okay, so... I'll take Hector this time, so I'll just... this is kind of a tricky level. There also is a secret shop on this level, I forgot. Well, I... that's up to you, because you're the one who has the secret shop card. Yeah, the thing is, they sell things like halberds and hammers and long swords and stuff like that, so I probably won't really even bother. I'm not taking Lee Galt. I will take the one. Gonna yeah, one, two, three, four, five. One, wait, one, two, three, six. Okay, you can take one more. Okay, cool. But right, great. Uh, you do want Hawkeye or no? No, no. Okay, not on this level. So much saving. Yeah, because we, we don't want to have to do that again. <laughs> I don't think we want to deploy Merlinus. Grr, not again! Wallace this is the seventy-fifth. Wow! <laughs> this is the seventy-fifth time he went to burn instead of Kalen. He look okay. Wallace, I just realized, looks like the actor Michael Chiklis. Does he? Who's the Thane in the old Fantastic Four movies? <laughs> then all this means I get Wallace. Whoop de doo. He's terrible. He has elixirs. <laughs> That's his one good quality, and a silver lance. Especially but since you already have Oswin. Yeah, I know. Uh. All right. Hmm. Check that. Okay, Lynn's finally Take getting that. good enough that she doesn't need the manicotti for everything. Take that. Is it Peach that's like, Take that? Take that! Is that I Mario need Kurt Kent 64? to go this way so he can talk to Wallace. Is that Mario Kart 64? Yeah. Take that! Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Great game. It's hard to pick up and play that, like, nowadays, I'll say. Is it? Yeah, it controls very weird compared to other Mario games. Or to, yeah, oh, yeah, to the other Mario Kart. Mario Kart. Sure. It's like picking up Goldeneye now. Like, <laughs> yeah, uh, okay, very, so like, very Goldeneye true. on the N64 grew up playing it. One of the first, like, shooter games I played. Great multiplayer. Um, took it to college, tried to get my roommates to play it. One of them had also grown up with it. We were great. 
loved it, jumped right back in, and then my other roommate was like, uh, this is unplayable. Yeah. Because you're, like, all shooters now use the two, like, sticks, or, yep. or you have, like, the mouse and keyboard set up. <laughs> yeah, it desperately needs a stick to aim. It, right, it just doesn't really work. Also, it's one of the, it's very laggy, especially if you're playing <laughs> at least three players. It is very With laggy. proximity mines in the facility. <laughs> Such a good game. I would do a let's play of that. I would, I'd have to upload it on Artie Uncolored, but... It's not that bad. There's like... Uh, it's definitely tea, though. There's ancient blood in it, that's about it. <laughs> not just regular blood, ancient blood. Well, but like, really it Wallace... doesn't really look like blood, it's just like, oh, I guess Bond has some red on his tuxedo. <laughs> I guess. We don't get Nino on this level, though, right? No. Jafar. Nino's three levels from now. I want to know what kind of tattoo Jafar has on that arm that's, like, basically obscure. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's a lizard. It is not a lizard. <laughs> Maybe it's just a scar, actually. I don't know. Does she give you something if you go to that house? No. She'll just, like, freak out. Be like, ah! Jafar is dying! I'm gonna send her off, I guess. I think we got this sound. Oh, definitely. Oh, Wow, Kent, you bad. Oh, Kent, you good. <laughs> and you doubted him. Level 17? Oh, nope, 15. 15. Not even close. <laughs> Orion's Bolt. You could sell that to Merlinus for some cash. So I could spend it at secret shops. Uh, probably not. Ah, you're no fun. Ooh, Arena. Also, keep in mind, Lloyd is not right on top of the castle, and he moves. That's true. That's a bad idea. With their are Wyvern Riders. Like Veda. Yes. Only they're, they're just average Wyvern Riders. <laughs> We're making puns Nobody's about... Nobody's gonna, like, get or enjoy that joke. Ah, uh, that's true. Thanks, Matthew, for blocking the way so no one else can get the EXP. Oh, I just wanted him to be on a, uh, fort. Could have been done that one. Yeah. I guess, I guess. And of course I had to get rid of the javelin, otherwise I could have finished him off. Mm. Well, I mean, I get to go first next turn anyways, so... Did you, okay, so you're, you've been playing Cave Story recently. I've, yeah, finished that Let's Play. So, question for you for that. So, I've played through that game, I think, twice. Mm -hmm. um, I never did the, like, Hell World or any of that, <laughs> which is insane, I right know. Um, did you find anything new playing it through? This is, okay. what, your third time? Um, I'm trying to think. Did I? Um... That's why I'm asking, I don't know the answer. Yeah, I, I want to say I did. <sighs> I've tried, okay, so I initially was Let's Playing that. I was doing Curly's story, which yeah, I never no, did I, before. I, I saw that video where you were like, yep, and I... Uh, oh, okay. It, uh, you didn't record or something, right? Yeah, it recorded a pitch black screen instead. That was nice. Let's see... Oh, I just realized, another game that I... Uh, this will be in a separate video, probably, but... Another game that I played this year that was great, Link's Awakening. Finally oh, beat yeah. it from start to finish, because I'd beaten it before by playing someone else's folder. Mm -hmm. And I made it up to Eagle Tower, which is the seventh dungeon, I think. And back Something in the like back in the original game, not the DX version, the original game, you can, like, permanently glitch yourself with that, okay. essentially. So I had that, and then was so fed up with the game. I'm like, ah, screw this. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna play it anymore. But I got it for 3DS Virtual Console with save states, <laughs> which is very nice. So that helped. Um, and it was nice to finally finish that. It's one of the few Zelda games I have not uh, beaten until now. Until now. Yeah, that's a fun one. It's tough to be sure, but dang it. Here, my, here's my thing with that one. The, the dungeons are not, like, any harder than Seasons or Ages, I don't think. 
But the overworld, like, everything in the overworld is set up to be like, oh, you can't go here until this. Yeah. Whereas Seasons and Ages, like, you feel like you can explore a little bit more, whereas that it's, like, very much like, yeah, you explore, but it'll be like, oh, there is one way to get to this one area. I can't really do anything, so... so. Vendor. Actually, no. Vendor machine. I don't need any of that. <laughs> you don't really need any of that. Oh, I guess vulnerabilities. <laughs> Those are always nice. Come on, Ken, pick up the pace. You need to talk to Wallace. Ken can't talk to Wallace. Can he? Yeah, he can. Oh. I thought a lord had to do it. Nope, Any, pretty much anyone from Winst- I think it's like Lynn, Kent, Sane, or Will can do it. Hey, bald guy, join our team. Oh yeah, I remember you from one story that you didn't play. The Flux Capacitor! Marty! Marty! It's about dark magic! I knew it because I hit my head on the toilet tank, and that is how I came up with the idea for the Flux Capacitor. Alright, who needs a healing? No one needs a healing. Kent does, but you're not near him. Oh, well, no, if I, I get move close first enough. on the next turn. Yeah, you do. Really, you're gonna put Sarah up there? Nope. Just in case Wyverns. Wallace is like attempting <clears throat> to go to town. Wow, Wallace, you really Okay, I forget. Stink. Does the boss move on this one? Yes. Why would you use your hand axe against the sword enemy? <laughs> he's got a silver lance. He's kind of an idiot. Just a bit. <laughs> oh. Earth seal. Oh yeah. Nice. I think we've got all the upgrade items that we need though, except for the heaven seals. Based on the characters we're using, yeah. I think we even have an extra guiding rain. Because I stole it. Yep. I just realized a lot of enemies in this, or a lot of bosses in this have guiding rings you can steal. Oh, Matthew. Just so you know, the boss is right oh, shoot. there. I thought he was to the right. Oh, I thought he had a white brand. Wait, can he attack me? No, you're just out of reach. Those other punks probably will, though. Ooh, red gem. I'm probably not gonna live to. Well, you know that. what? I actually will not cry if I don't get Wallace, because that means I get pent. You were gonna get Wallace. Because I want pent. <laughs> Kent will well, talk. Okay. Kent will talk to Wallace. I don't I only have one magic guy. I need some more javelins. Javelin. Custo. Maybe only like one or two of those. Okay, I swear, I swear there were Wyvern Riders. Maybe hard mode? Or Hector's story? I might I must be thinking Hector's story. Also for those who are curious, the secret shop is, I believe, right there. They don't have the secret shops in the new Fire Emblem games, do they? No, they don't. Also, if you play on Hector, uh, hard mode, I think maybe only Hector's story hard mode, uh, the weird guy on Imprisoner of Magic has a silver card you can steal. Halves the price of uh, chips. Yep. You need that. <laughs> oh, Matthew's fine. Oh, yeah. I was just worried that he was moving far enough ahead. Oh, Ballista. Oh! oh! No! Whoa! Oh! No! And he had so much good swag. That is tragic. Oh, well. Oh first my guy gosh. To die. Not a perfect run anymore, guys. Ah. Oh, oh. that, that is really unfortunate. Oh, I better ah! start Sarah. Oof. <laughs> oh. I guess, you know, we've been playing with fire. Oswin should have died twice. <laughs> so I guess it's time for Matthew to finally, to finally, you know, go. Oh. Who needs healing, Kent? He was one of the guys there I... There you go, Kent! He's one of the guys I, like, put the most into. Yeah, I know. Ugh. Yeah, he had a lot of swag, didn't he? Yeah, he did. He had my killing edge. 
Um, can Austin and Rebecca can probably uh, take let's those see. guys Let's see. Will Lynn be in danger? Yeah, Lynn will probably be in danger for a time. Somebody should put it to go in that forest. I'm wondering, should I have, like, I was gonna If you can take out one of the guys, I can take out the other, probably. Okay. Uh, steel, I guess. Oh, yeah, we need odds one up there. Oof. Oh. That, wow. Oh. The, this just got a lot more exciting and dangerous. I guess. I and level 27, I feel, is gonna kick our butts. Is that Kaga Destiny? Yep. <laughs> yeah. I have a hunch we're going to lose quite a few guys Is that there. the one where you get beta? Yep. I don't think we're going to lose quite a few guys, but I can see us losing one. Alright, I'll put Lynn in the forest. Should have had... Link if Matthew had had the killing edge, he'd still be alive. But he had to have the stupid iron blade equipped. Yeah, lowers his speed. Oh. Oh, that's very disappointing. That's the kind of death where I totally would have reset if we weren't playing in the yep. set. Yep. Oh. Uh, no, don't move him up there. Void will be able to kill him. Oh, Kanas, Kanas, okay. Kanas should be out of range. Oof. Hopefully Kanas won't die as well. That would be really bad. That, I would be like, my team would be crippled. Yeah. Then you'd, like, have to use Hawkeye. I'd, like, have to have Hector, like... Oh! If he's oh, no, in range the Ballista! Oh! Oh my no! god! <laughs> oh. I almost <laughs> want one of my lords to die you just so we can... there were with Vern Riders. Oh. I almost, like, want to let one of my lords oh. die at this point, just so... No, it, it it's Because it's in... Because this is going to hurt me, too. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. That's so bad. I will gladly take Wallace so you can get pent. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. That's kind of highlights our playing style, so I tend to be a lot more cautious. Artie is very cautious. And um, I'm much more... I play on the edge a little bit. And you know, yep. sometimes that comes back and bites you in the butt. It is true, it is Twice, true. Twice, apparently. Alright, oh. I need Wallace, because Wallace is in range. Oh. I'm gonna kick Wallace in the face. <laughs> Alright, Wallace, move out. And by that I mean move back. And now, because of Matthew dead, we can't see... I'll just say, Moe's right there. He's actually not on the gate. Put somebody, put like a strong unit in that little forest. Right here? Yeah. That way you know what it's like to suffer too. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Oh. So tragic. It was It was tragic. That was a combined like 30 something levels. And can I, okay, how are we gonna beat um, uh, Limstella? Uh, Dart. That's a berserker. Do you have Athos on that level, or no? Nope. Level before. Ooh, we could lose some guys on that level, too, then. Because that Kanas is, like, the way to take her out. Yep. Oh, Yeesh. no. Wait for Dart! Dang it. <sighs> well, I guess this means I'll have to use Legault more. Or you Legault. don't have to. Well, I mean, he's our only thief now. We don't Hi! Really... This is the point in the game where you don't really need thieves. Like well, basically just like if you this is why I gave Sarah a physics staff. Oh my gosh. Way to go, Lord. Good thing I didn't give like one of them Aphas drops, so that would have been like the worst trade ever. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Venus, if no. any of our guys move like closer then No. You need just put Oswin up there. Oswin can draw him out. I don't know if he does move in Elwood's story, because Lowen is definitely in range of him. Oh yeah, but he was also surrounded by other guys. Yeah, but he could Oh, that Lowen. could be bad. Light magic? You have Lowen, he's fine. Just have Lowen move and take the guy out. She can heal him. Damn it. 
Thanks, Serenity Sons. No, literally nobody is gonna get that out. But you would, so. Ugh. Ooh! Rebecca should totally get in that ballista. Yeah, she will. But actually she might not because you never attack twice in a ballista. I, I, you might I'm wondering to, you probably we... need her to take those guys out. So that's kinda of might have sick. Oh, that's only ten. You damage. should have Lowen take out Oh, pff, never have, mind. You should have Lowen take out the magician. I'm wondering that or the Wyvern Riders, because those take out a huge chunk of damage. I'll take out the Wyvern Riders. Both of them? Yeah. Then okay. If you say so. What does Lloyd have? A silver sword. You probably want a lance then, right? Probably. This is risky. You're fine. Well, I don't want to lose any more guys, I'll just say that. You haven't lost anybody! I believe that's true. You should have lost Oswin twice now. Or no, Oswin once, Lin once. The Lin one was my fault, though. Yes, it was. Also, a village up there with a silent staff, if we care. Nah. That really only comes in handy on that level with the guy with bolting. We might want to have Kent put a barricade there, just so Void won't be able to go past there. I don't know if Kent's high enough level for that. Well, now Raven's in range of Void. Maybe Kent will rescue him. That's an option, yeah. Never underestimate the power of re the rescue. At least Rebecca's still alive. She'll be fine. If I lose her, like, I might as well just stop playing. <laughs> Jeez, though. No. To lose... For... No, he'll be in range. I'm moving Lin out of the way. Put Lin in that forest on the, r or on the right. Move him up a little bit, and Wallace up a little bit. I don't know if Lloyd moves. Oh, maybe he doesn't. Maybe he only moves after you attack him? I think he only moves in hard mode or Hector's story. Yes, please use your ballista against Wallace. Dang! Reinforcements everywhere. Also, Hustle once, once we defeat Lloyd, we win. So. Alright. Alright, this looks good. Don't forget there's reinforcements down there. Good call. I think they might be magic guys. Not nice. Oh, I mean, I might as well. Should you? <laughs> That's like kind of a waste. Those are rare and expensive. She needs EXP. Bad. Move Wallace down. <sighs> Whoa, Wallace is way more movement than I gave him credit for. Oh, I thought they appeared in those. Yeah, so did I. Dart's like, I, all I've done this time is destroy a snag and buy some stuff. Man, it must have been, it must have been ages then since I played Outwood Story Normal Mode. Oh, wait, I go first for Yep. You can hope Lloyd can't move, because Lowen could be dead. Right as he hits level 20. That would be so tragic. Yeah, he doesn't move. Good. Ah! I got this. I got this. Do you want me to get that one? Um, Dart can get the Myrmidon. Or one of them, I guess. Because Wowen's gonna upgrade today. 
And he'll be our first unit we upgrade. Unless you're like, no, Ken! <laughs> <laughs> The fog of war levels. You always gotta watch out for those fog of war levels. When you first Whoa, play, when you nice. played this the first time, how many characters died? Oh, quite a few. I think I had maybe four or five the first time I played. Actually, no, no, no. Never mind. I had only like three or four until the Lim Stella level, and I didn't know the trick to beating her, and I think I lost like six guys. Yeah, that's understandable. Oh, I'm at 3 HP. Move back. We need to move somebody up enough that we can see Linus. Or Lloyd, or whatever his Lloyd, name is. Lloyd, yeah. Nice! Alright, so Lloyd, I think, is right there, so. Lloyd's gonna move here and use his Knight's Crest. Actually, wait. This is pretty epic. This is like when a Pokemon evolves. It's better than that. They get struck by lightning like 20 times. And then he teleports die. to the left side of the room, like in Willy Wonka. <laughs> Wonka vision. And now he's basically Marcus. Only better. A nice level up. Oh, he had a actually... lot of constitution. And now we can use axes? Oh, heck yeah. Alright. False alarm. Send Lynn down to take care of the other butts. Also, well, actually, never mind. I bought out an Iron Axe, so I'm good. Basically, it's like, oh, never mind. I was gonna say, remember all of our friends from Lin's story? They all died on this level. They're like, oh wait, just nope. Matthew. <laughs> Kanas was the. Actually, the interesting thing, Kanas is the only one who dies in canon, like at the end of this game. Oh, he actually dies. Yeah, like his ending thing is, it's like he dies, like trying to like save his orphanage or something like that. Oh, that's weird. Because it's like, I know in Fire Emblem the Six you get, like, his, uh, mother, I think. And she's a druid. She's a druid. Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Yeah, Wallace can help her out if she... Yeah. She's fine. No, not the Slim Sword. Why do you even still have that? I don't know. Throw it on the floor. Do the dinosaur. What? I might rescue her. <laughs> Wallace can tank it. Unless you want my two guys to uh, go back to life. <laughs> there might be more guys down there. We don't really know. I guess that's true. So I would rescue her just in case and just finish this cursed level. Yeah. Should have been hammer time. Hammer time? I only use those against knights. <laughs> he double shots a little, uh, Mullen. Dane. How about Oswin? He probably will double shot Oswin as well. But Oswin has much better defense. Yeah, I should probably rescue Lin. Mm -hmm. I think this is another time where we should just have uh, Hector do his thing. If Hector wants to go on ahead, go right ahead. Unless that's your secret plan to get back your key units. Secret plan to overthrow Hector. No one's gonna get that one either. I know. Oh, it's I hard need when a javelin. Don't get the references because you made it up. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> What's Elwood uh, gonna do? Uh, what? Nope. Why does Void have so much speed? Because he's a swordmaster. Actually, Oswin's gonna take a ton of damage too. All right. Yeah. See how Hector fares. <laughs> Actually, better. Do you want me to just leave him there? Hang on. Does he have a crit chance? Void. A little bit. A little bit. I'm fine. All right. Yeah. Sure. Do that. Sarah can I heal just him if he gets healing on the next turn. Yeah, that's fine. Shoot him. Let's go on, Rebecca. Hey, Barky. Thank you for that. Um, Probably no. nobody will get that reference either. Can I just wait? Yeah, sure. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I've actually never seen that. Shoot. Special animation, or special... Um, <laughs> Hector's maxed out in strength. Him? Yeah, Physic Hector. Glad to see that Physic Staff is getting put to good use. She's level 6? Nope, 14. 14, that, I keep that even thinking she's like, that people are like two levels ahead of where they are. Don't actually I'm instigate I'm not doing it, I'm just... I'm gonna leave him there again, I think. Yeah, that's fair. And I'm, oh wait, I'm gonna use Rebecca? Oh, yeah, good thinking. It's good thing he isn't on the gate then, because he'd constantly be getting more HP. Let's see if I can finish him off. Yeah, I don't think so. You could put him there, except for he has a 14 crit chance. Oh, yeah, that's nasty. <laughs> That'd be hilarious if Oswin survived, like, all these other terrible things. <laughs> I mean, like, I might as well, right? Sure. It's unless he moves now. Even then, Hector's walking the way. Not to Dart. True, but Dart Darts has a lot of HP. He should survive. I would just move Oswin up there, and between Hector and Oswin, somebody will take him out on the next turn. Yeah. Alright. And get Elwood close enough that he can, like, make it to the end and seize on the end of his turn. No, it's just you defeat Lloyd. Boom. No. Level over. Hector, baby. Ba -ba 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 Not that song. Hang on. Ba -ba. How much does void damage per hit? 11, I think. Okay, good. He'll still survive. Rebecca will say. Thus far, Rebecca's the only one who can, like, consistently hit Lloyd. <laughs> I'm almost debating just, like... If you throw, like, everything at him, he'll probably kill someone. <laughs> <laughs> That's the pain. And I'm totally cool with Hector getting the experience for him, so... Wait again... Sure. Darn it, Hector! He only has like a 40% chance. Alright, well Hector needs to get out of there now. Because even with physics, yep. he's not gonna have enough. It won't restore full. Nope. Not even close. Sure, might as well, right? Yeah, sure, might as well. Have Oswin just finish the job. Ugh. That's the thing. You know what? <laughs> just have Oswin sit there then and be the new Hector. <laughs> He's the new Hector. I'll have Wowen sit as well. Fine. He will die on this turn then. Just end. And we should Rebecca shoot. Oh, there's no ammo. There's left. no ammo left. Die already, Lloyd. Urg. Great death quote. It's the best. He went down like the punk he was. I can't believe I lost two guys on this level. Ah, oh. I know. Is that going to be in your 2016 highlight video? No, because this video was not going to be uploaded in 2016. Oh, that's true. When is the 2016 highlight video coming out? Uh, January 1st, probably. Do you have it like done? I've got at least part one done. Oh, actually, no, I don't, parts. because it... Are they actually all highlights, or is it just like, oh, this part was pretty amusing? It's basically any part I thought was cool, funny, or, like, just... Worth so it's basically just gonna be, like, a, like, clip show of Artie being every single final boss in every game that he's doing. <laughs> That's how it used to be. <laughs> he looks like a guy I went to school with. <laughs> Does he? <laughs> he says brown hair instead of black hair. Oh, yeah. And he doesn't have glasses. I know which one you're talking about. No, you don't. <laughs> no, I don't? Nope. This kid was like a huge chain smoker, but could play DDR like nobody's business. Okay. But only for like one dance, and then he'd be like huffing and puffing like the big bed wolf. <laughs> Creepy girl. She's basically if Wednesday Adams was like a character in this. 
Mm. Oh yeah. And, and Jafar was like, finally bleeding. Jafar was like bleeding out in this house. <laughs> Like the entire time, every, every like time we waited, Jafar was like just got a little bit closer to death. <laughs> Ouch! Jafar's like, I would have killed me. <laughs> it's almost like she's talking to us. She's like, I wouldn't let someone, someone die. No. Stand by me. Yeah, she's like, I won't let anybody die, and then it's like, as soon as you get her, she just keeps killing people left and right, like, doesn't even care. I was thinking, like, because of what happened on this stage. Dang! Linus, you really should go to anger management. I think you could benefit Linus, from Linus, like, needs a shirt. <laughs> yeah, that's weird, he's just he's like, oh, I've got a six-pack, <laughs> I guess, I mean, if you had that six-pack, oh. like, why wouldn't you just show it off? Okay, this Kane. He looks so familiar, like, doesn't he? I mean, he looks like a cane. Also, this guy is such a butt. Yeah, probably. Like, you learn how much of a butt he is even more so in 6. Do you, like, know all the plot of 6, basically? <laughs> I've played a few levels, and... You've played, like, two levels! Oh, I at least know him. Well, you're always that... like, yeah, I think you were running to, like, Kanasa's dad in Fire Emblem 6. <laughs> I'm like, uh... How do you know that if you played two levels? I didn't actually get recruit her. I do know more about this guy though, just from like the second level though. Hmm. She's basically like Cersei from Game of Thrones. I just realized. <laughs> Is she? She's just kind of like power hungry. The Fire Emblem seems to be something different in each game. Yep. Each universe has a different Fire Emblem. So in Awakening, it's like a shield, and in this, it's like a gem. And in the GameCube one, it's an emblem! Go figure! I don't- yeah, I think it's in the GameCube one. I think it's like a stone. Oh. I'm not sure, though. It's been so long since I played the GameCube one. That is so hard. Man, what a bot King Desmond. Man, this is a long movie scene. Hey, look, it's like Elwood's dad. <laughs> it's not. It's, hot, it's, but... the, it's like the random guard who's in every single castle. Ah, uh, Louise. Is that, are they sisters or something? I no, they're like distant relatives. That's all you know. You can tell because they both have blonde hair, apparently. Yeah, More they're the only stuff? characters in the game who don't have like a weird hair color. <laughs> it's kind of true. Now that I think about it, yeah, are there any? I mean, Ella Woods. I guess red. Lucius. Yeah, Raven is normal. Kent, I guess, could be normal. Same as normal. Kent's Will hair is as tomato red as Ella Woods. Will is normal. All right, that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. Link the Hero 64. Tune in for the next episode. We'll be facing off against Vader. Your average wyvern right off. Exactly. Anyways, have a great day and God bless. Woo.